Why, hello you, and welcome to Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Harry Potter lived at number four Privet Drive with his horrible uncle and aunt and their hateful son Dudley. Harry was often locked in his room, and even though he is a wizard, he couldn't escape because he wasn't allowed to use magic when he was away from school. Why is he in his room? One evening, a house elf named Dobby appeared. Harry Potter must not go back to Hogwarts. If Harry Potter goes back to Hogwarts, he will be in mortal danger. Dobby disappeared, and shortly after, Harry's best friend Ron Weasley and his brothers Fred and George arrived in a flying Ford Anglia to rescue Harry from his prison. They flew him to their home, the Burrow, where Harry spent the rest of the summer before traveling by flu powder to Diagon Alley. Harry met up with Ron's sister, Ginny, and went with her to Flourish and Blots, where the famous wizard author, Gilderoy Lockhart, was signing his latest book. Great Scott, is that? No, surely not! It is! It's Harry Potter! <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this is the perfect moment for me to make an important announcement. I have great pleasure in announcing that I will be taking up the post of Defence Against the Dark Arts teacher at Hogwarts. Oh! <laughs> oh! <laughs> what the fuck? Bet you loved that, didn't you, Potter? Famous Harry Potter. Can't even go into a bookshop without making the front page. Leave him alone. He didn't want all that. Is that Potter, Jimmy? you've got yourself a girlfriend. I suppose your parents will go hungry for a month to pay for all the books you're going to need at Hogwarts. It's the least I can do to help out the poor and needy. My father will hear about this. Harry! We've missed the train! The Hogwarts Express left five minutes ago! Oh no! What are we going to do? You're in Diagon Alley. Well, You're screwed. I know that Dad took the flying car to work this morning. It's parked in Charing Cross Road. Okay, it's our only chance of getting to school on time. <laughs> Being sure to check that no one was watching, Ron and Harry took off in the old Ford Anglia. Now all we've got to worry about are airplanes. <laughs> I can't see anything in here. Phew, that was close. I think we're almost there. Uh-oh, I think the car's cutting out. Come on, car. Come on! Stop! 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 <laughs> Flipendo, let's go. Don't worry, Ron. <laughs> I'll come and get you. Just hold on. I can't do anything else. Hurry up, Harry. What is this? <laughs> Boss, I figured out the technology to cinematics. Brilliant, brilliant, Robert. Put in five straight in the beginning. Oh, no, there's no strafing in this. It just... Oh, no. Oh, no. Wait. Huh? <gasps> Yes! WASD! Oh, they move from the arrow keys! The improvements! You've done it, Robert! Flipendo! No? Alright. Well, welcome to Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. There was no, like, menu thingy to uh, allow me time to say hello. But hello, my name is Stefan, and welcome to Harry Potter. Oh. with the Alahamora spell. To cast a spell, press and hold the left mouse button. Thanks. Flipendo. Right. Right. 
in Chamber of Secrets, they redid the whole chest, so instead of all springing out at once, I just have to walk into them. they uh, they come out one by one. Oh, that's gonna get tedious. Hey, at least my one is lighting up now. Walk into them to save the current state of your game. When you faint, your game will automatically revert to the point where and when you last touched a save book. What do you mean when I faint? I'm not gonna faint. This guy clearly did not see my Harry Potter and Philosopher's Stone playthrough. Then he would know that I cannot faint. Reveal your secrets! I hope they have as many secrets in Gem of Secrets at, as they did in Philosopher's Stone. Flipendo! Whoa, everything is so smooth now. God, what a step up though. It feels exactly like the first game. This branch is squeezing me like a snake! Yes, yes. It feels like the first game, but just better in every way. Oh! Press enter to skip cutscene. Chocolate frogs replenish some of your stamina. They also taste delicious. Uh -huh. Chocolate frog. <laughs> <laughs> can open up magically locked objects such as chests and secret doors. You already said that. My god, this is just gonna be Harry Potter and the secret of cutscenes, isn't it? Give me the birdie pot. Every flavor beans. Let me through. Oh! Good job, Harry. Now, see if you can cast for a pendo on this branch to get it off me. I think I see a sensitive spot right there. Where? Where do you see a scent? Was it here? I, I don't know where you want me to cast Flipendo, Ron. Oh, there, I see. That was really well Sorry. hidden. Much appreciated. <laughs> You're welcome, but now you can't get down. Oh, no! Oh, hey, it started again. Buy car. My dad won't be happy that I lost his flying car. Anyway, we better get a move on. We don't want Professor Snape catching us out so late. Did they change voice actors for all the characters? Because it feels like they did. Not only does cast light, it also reveals magically hidden things. <laughs> Why do you explain that after I've already done it once? What? To jump, run to the ledge and press the right mouse button. Try collecting the beans on all the ledges, Harry! Alright, Ron! I'm gonna do Ron it! Birdie bots every flavor beans. I should collect as many as I can. They'll come in handy later. That's Fred and George. Oh, Harry, I you missed need the frog. To get onto this ledge over here. Yes, yes. Yes, yes. Yoink! I will help Fred and George. Flipendo. Flipendo to push the block towards me. And then use it to jump to this ledge. Is that auto jump in this? No, there isn't. Oh, what a game changer. Okay, I'm gonna faint in this game like a million times. Because I got so used to auto jump. <laughs> oh. No cutscene for me, Ronald. That was loud. Oh, that's a really ear cutting sound effect. What? I mean, that's a secret if I've ever seen one. Hang up. Come back, wall slip. There was a secret in here. Ah, oh, three beans. Okay. <gasps> it's a card! This is a bronze wizard card. There are 50 of these scattered throughout Hogwarts. Each time you collect 10 bronze cards, you're given a permanent stamina increase. Pressing the escape key will allow you to access the Folio Magi and look at the wizard cards you've collected thus far. Folio Magi? What does Folio mean? I thought it would be Portfolio. Hmm. Flipendo, give me your beans. Oh, wait, oh my god, that's delayed. <laughs> that's gonna drive me nuts. Flipendo. Can I cast it straight away at least? Yes. Oh my, come on. Flip, flip. We're done here, Ron. Hmm. 
No, no secrets? Okay. Man, you can't see like a big empty space like this without any... Yeah, you, you just know there's a secret stopped. somewhere. At least we'll be dry when we get expelled. Come on! We'd better get up to the school! Was it raining before? Maybe I just didn't notice. Maybe my graphics settings are just not high enough to render fidelity such as rain. Look at all the stars. Stars. Wow. So pretty. But look at this dragon, Harry. It has Bertie butts. Every flavor beans. <laughs> I'll be right there, Ron. <laughs> He's just standing up there. Harry, relate and you're collecting candy. I hope Ron didn't get lost. <laughs> yeah. I uh, <laughs> What the fuck? I sure hope Ron didn't get lost as well. Harry, you're the lost one, you idiot. I took you on a detour. You lost, Ronald? Can't find the castle? Hmm. Should have followed me then. Because I took the direct path. What an idiot. <laughs> what the fuck? Ah, see? There we go. Ron got lost again. The chest is over here. No joke if someone drove up to me and said, uh... Hey kid, if you get in my van, I'll give you some beans. I'd get in the van. What is this? That kind of looks like a um, spring. Oh, I see chest. And I haven't opened that chest. Hang on, Ronald. I'll be right back, buddy. <laughs> Fuck, I'm the worst friend in the world. How do I get up there, though? I don't think I can get up there yet. Maybe we get back out here. My friend did tell me that this game had more... Um, more open world elements to it. How the heck would one get up there? It's okay, just I'll get you some other time. Maybe I can form a bridge from over here or something. Maybe there's a gargoyle. Yeah, no, these definitely help me get up to places. It's a nice night now the rain has stopped. It is a nice night. Oh. Bye, Ronald. Oh, come on, I know that spell, but was it Incendio? No, it wasn't. Oh, wow. We used it in Sorcerer's Stone, but it wasn't Incendio. I don't think it was. It was like the thing that burned away plants. Guess this Pokemon has not learned Cut yet. Oh, I want that card so bad. What a mean game, making me pass on secrets and cards. Yeah, okay, so there's no way. I'm definitely getting back here at some point. It's okay. We don't get everything now. I can wait. It's not gonna make me go insane at all. I'm gonna lose my mind. Did you see that through the door? That was just a painting. The Gryffindor dormitory is just over here to the right, remember? They didn't render the hole at all. It was just like a painting, like a little square box with paintings on all the walls. Brilliant game. Wow, this is just like the first game, but way higher fidelity. It's insane. Back in the days, you could notice such a big graphical improvement from game to game, and you were just you were so excited for the next iteration of a game because the, the, the graphics and controls and everything were just so improved. Look at these lighting effects. It looks so cozy with all the mood light. Oh, the nostalgia. There's a chest up there, and there's another... This is definitely like a springy thing. There's just no way it isn't. No! My bean! Break your legs for it, Harry! Come on! Come, come. Sacrifice! Got it. We don't know if they actually vanish out, but there's one in here. I see it. <gasps> no! Oh, whew. I got it. Be right there, Ronald. No! Come sir! Oh, the biggest fear is that you can't get a bean. Mm, nothing. 
If, the, if you start on this series and not Sorcerer's Stone for whatever reason, you are killing yourself right now. Oh! Oh no. That card better stay there for the next time I come around, otherwise I'm gonna be so mad. If you're thinking, wow, you're running around like an idiot, clearly there are no secrets. See? You're wrong! This is the house point ceremony chamber. No, it's not. Ew. Whoa, I'm losing health from that. Don't... Can, flipendo? No. Oh, this is completely different, though. Ah. The clever ones. The clever ones that save their own ass. The brave idiots and... Hoofle... Hoofle poo. I never heard of these. They must be new to the game. I don't think they were in the books or the movie. Don't remember them, at least. <laughs> That's a secret. <laughs> hello, hello, my homo. Point. My HP just went green for a while. Does that just mean I healed, or did I overheal? I think I overhealed. Like you had more than your max HP for a while. I'll be right there, Ronald. Wow, this castle is so much bigger. You call that an evil laugh? <laughs> That's an evil laugh, you idiot. I can do a better one, but it's gonna be too long. Chances are people are watching this when they're sleeping. Oh, you are dazzling, my dude. Look at those luscious locks. What the fuck? <laughs> they're all old wearing top hats, but not this guy. Freaking Greek god. My neighbors must be thinking, what is he doing? Playing? Oh. Oh, Flipendo. What's a cauldron good for? Flipendo? No. <gasps> a silver card. Nice. Uh, wizard cards. Andre the Inv Invincible? Hmm. Can't use that cauldron yet. Maybe that's a Snape thing. Snape was barely in the first game. Oh, hello, Ronald. Oh. Could have just said that straight away, I would have come. It's the fat lady. She wasn't in the first Finally, game at all. There's the portrait of the pink lady. Give her the password and let's go to bed. Pink I lady? Thought you'd have the password. Why would I have the password? Why would I have it? I've been with you since we got here. You're right. I better know who would have it. There you are. Right on time. I heard the most incredible story about you two getting expelled over a flying car. Oh, Marnie, please! We're tired! Could you just tell us what the password is? Wattlebird. It's good to see you again, Harry. Interesting little cinematic. There you two are. Brilliant entrance. Got the year off with a bang. Mum's furious, by the way. You two should hear about the bean trading system we've set up. It's based on Bertie Bot's Every Flavor Beans. Nice, Nick. Fred, myself, and several of our associates have set up trading opportunities throughout Hogwarts. Some of us will occasionally have an item to trade. If you have enough beans, we'll trade with you. Where are we supposed to get all these beans? They're hidden all over the place. It's not hard to find them. You should have enough to start trading in no time. <sighs> Gee, Harry. It's a pleasure doing business with you, I'm sure. I wonder where the beans are. <laughs> Idiot. Once inside the common room, Harry was greeted by the cheers of his fellow Gryffindors. Harry and Ron became Gryffindor heroes due to their little accident with the Whomping Willow. Harry slept well that night and looked forward to his first day at Hogwarts. Good morning, Harry! 
Look at how mine is here. Defense against the dark arts lesson with Professor Lockhart. I just love his books. He's such a brilliant writer. Defense against the dark arts on the third floor. Follow us. Remember how I gave you fashion tips in Sorcerer's Stone where I said don't shave off your eyebrows and paint them back on? Here is fashion tip number two from Stefan himself. Don't cut bangs. Please. Do not cut... <gasps> the card is still up there. Thank God. That's all I had to check. Do not cut bangs. I don't care if you're home alone right now during this whole pandemic. Do not cut bangs. Besides cars fly. I've been in there. Yes, I can actually. With Vingardium and Levionzan. Harry, defense against the dark arts is up here. Try to hurry, Harry. We'll get to see Gilderoy Lockhart in person. I mean, you will. Because I'm a bit confused about. Hey, there he is again. There he is again. There he is again. Hi, would you consider a trade? There he is. Like, what the hell? He's everywhere. That painting. What? Why would? Okay. <laughs> there he is again. What? Oh. Look at all these idiots. I just got a card. Ethidred the. Ever ready? I can barely read it. It's so tiny. Okay, what can you trade? Oh, sorry, I just sold my very last item a moment ago. What would you? Okay. Sorry, I've run out of stock. You'd have to come back. What do you have? I have flubberworm mucus for a limited time only. Press on the yes button to accept the trade, or the no button to decline. What? What is it? Sure. Thanks. Oh no. I'm always glad to sell to you, Harry. Okay. Wow, boy, am I glad that I just made that purchase. Oh, what a, a steal. She basically just sneezed in my hand and took my money. What? Alright. Staircase. Oh, it worked. Haha. -ha. Oh, the captain of the Holy Head of Harpies. Hello, hello, Sir Nicholas. Harry. Oh, hello, Nick. Even after all these years, I still find new secrets in Hogwarts. Here's a special area that you can unlock only if you collect all 40 silver wizard cards. It's a lot of cards, Nick. For every 10 silver wizard cards you collect, you'll get a key that will allow you to open one of the four locks on the door. See if you can find all 40 silver wizard cards hidden throughout Hogwarts and the grounds. Found two secrets right here, buddy. Flipendo. Making make my money so fast. Let me in. I have one silver card, I think. Maybe two. It's okay though. Wait, where were they? Were they all the way up there? Gosh. More beans. I need silver cards though. 40 of them, Jesus Christ. Oh. Okay, you know what? We're actually gonna make beans in no time. Because there are... Oh, look at... 76 beans. And you guys thought I was crazy for buying mucus. But clearly I'm rolling in dough. I don't think this is the right way. Ah, it was the right way. There's one of these. <laughs> Thank you. Wait. But I was just... I was just here. Oh, they keep going. Alright. Sure. Uh, I think I'm gonna end this episode here before we get to the first lesson now. It's been uh, it's been a good first day at Hogwarts. There are so many duplicate paintings here. Is that Mona Lisa? Okay, sure. <laughs> Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed this first episode of Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. Let me know if you got hit by that and nostalgia. 
Um, I, I sh like, it would be fun to, to hear from you guys what you remember from these games and what you completely forgot. Because when I played the first game, I was so surprised by things where I was like, okay, I never made it this far in the game. And then suddenly something came up that I remember crystal clear. It's just, something stick, something stump. Yeah, that was Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets. I'll see you around, I guess, tomorrow for the next episode. Bye, you.